Hi, this is Ryan from Maker Gear, and I'm going to show you how to unbox your Maker Gear M2. When you open your box, the first thing you're going to see is this 11 by 17 getting started guide. Today we're going to cover step one, which is getting your printer out of the box. First, remove the central block of foam by pulling straight up. This is the extruder. Move it to the center carefully. It should slide easily. Now, grab the foam by the two large blocks and pull straight up. Next, slide the extruder over to get it out of the way. And then we're going to push the mounting plate with this foam block forward. You'll have to push the foam block from behind. At this point, the foam block is ready to come out. Now, slide the mounting plate back to its central position. This rectangular piece is called the heated build platform, or HBP. We're going to carefully pull it out of its slot and slide it onto the mounting plate. The corners will fit snugly. The printer is now ready to come out of the box, but first let's move the extruder to the middle. Now we're going to grab the printer by both sides. This part's easier with a, sec a second set of hands. The foam block will probably come out with the printer, and that's not a problem. Getting the printer out of the foam can be tricky. Having an extra set of hands again would be helpful in this case. Regardless, never grab the printer by the top, always grab the printer by the sides. If you're doing this alone, grab the printer by the left side and lift up until you see the rubber feet. Now the printer is basically free to come out and you can set it down on the table. We call this the Z-axis knob. We use it to manually raise and lower the HPP. Right now we're turning it clockwise so we can pull the foam block out from beneath the HPP. This is your Boris Lulkit glass build plate. It has a golden film on it. This golden film is a polyamide material and your printer will print directly onto this film. I'm lowering the bed right now so that I can remove the stop sheet beneath it. Please open and read this document as it contains important information. And now you're ready to move on to step two of your getting started guide. And as always, please read your user manual as it contains a wealth of useful information.